Hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda, otherwise known as the Tangle Skeins Crafter. And today I have a little, maybe not so little, but Timu haul for diamond paintings in diamond crafts, I guess. You, anyway, um, let's see, where should I start? I'll start with the diamond paintings. Sorry, I have several. I still have more coming, I think. I went on a little bit of a buying binge, but I need to stop now. <laughs> All right, this first one is no longer available. It's sold out right now, but I paid $3.59 for this one. package and still not get, getting them open. There we go. Now people my age, <laughs> I don't know about people younger, but people my age will recognize this character. I absolutely loved Marvin the Martian growing up. Man, it's really folded. It'll be fine. This is just a little 30 by 40. Pretty simple image. I think it's got 20 colors, so I think it's going to be plenty for this image. Twenty colors. Looks like the symbols are just numbers and letters. It's clearly printed. It's on this sparkly canvas I keep getting lately. I don't know if it can you see the sparkle. Got really good stick to it. I mean, not a whole lot to say. It's just it's Marvin the Martian. Look at the shoes on the dog. I really did. I absolutely loved this cartoon growing up. I used to have a watch of Marvin the Martian. Let's look at the kit. It's just a regular pink wax, green boat, single placer pin usually get with these kits. Let's look at the drills. Comes in the train. Let's see if you can see the colors. Nice and shiny. Looks like they're pretty uniform in size. I don't see a lot of trash in there. I don't see any actually yet. Oh, nope, that's just a drill on the side. I don't see any odd shapes. Right now I'm not even seeing any random colors in there. So this is actually really nicely packaged. green. Oh, it's not showing up. Vib it's very vibrant to my eyes. On my monitor, it's it's more of a dull color. There's one odd one. This looks like a pretty nice kit. Usually with some of these cheaper kits, I find a lot of trash and a lot of odd colors in the drills, and I'm not seeing any. I don't see any weird globs. Yeah, I think this is a pretty good kit, especially for three dollars. Let us say three dollars and <sighs> look at me not be able to find the price. Three dollars and fifty nine cents. As I said, right now it's showing that it is sold out. I don't know. Sometimes they come back in stock. Sometimes they never do. But yeah, so cute. I look forward to working on this. I'm going to try to go through these pretty fast since I have several. So I said these are all from Timu. These are all stuff I paid for myself 
and or one in the Timu games. Okay, this one. This one is called Maple Leaf Fox. It's four forty eight currently. I paid four forty nine, but I did get my penny refund since the price changed. Sparkly canvas. It's also a 30 by 40. Also not a very intricate image, so I had hopes for this size. It's got 19 colors. And it's just such a cute little fox. Just playing in some leaves. It's like, it's really sticky, but it's like a weirder, it's like a stickier sticky than the other was. More of a gluey, soft sticky. I don't know how to explain, but either way, it's nicely sticky. I really hope this image turns out well because it is so cute. Very sparkly canvas. Clearly printed. Easy to see the symbols, which are all letters and numbers. Comes with the same kit, the boat, the wax, the single placer pin. I have a whole pile of those sitting over there. I'll look at the drills next. It's just such a cute image. I keep looking at it instead of what I'm doing. I think every kit I get, I talk about, talk about how excited I am to work on this. And then I put them up for like ever a bit. It's so cute and I love the colors. I'm assuming that's probably the background. Yeah, because the background and looks like it's belly and stuff's so all this creamy white, off-white color. I'm assuming it's like a cream. It's off-white. Again, they look like they're good quality little drills. They're not I don't see a bunch of trash. I don't see odd shapes, they all look uniform. They're all sparkly. Well faceted, you know. Reflecting the light nicely. That's like a light pink. There we go. I'm moving too much for it to focus, I guess. Orange, yellow, really pale. Peachy color. I will have a link in my description box. This one is still available. Do you like foxes too? I think foxes are so cute. Especially like baby foxes. You ever seen the fox and the hound? I loved that cartoon growing up. Alright. Um, this next one I got free through one of the Timu games. Okay, this one I got for free through a Timu game, but it is listed as $2.69 currently. It's a small 25 by 25 centimeter little kit. I do enjoy some of these small ones. Just takes a few hours to do them. Nice break in between the big ones. 
it is Scooby-Doo. Just like a silhouette. 12 colors. Oh, and the background's not all just one. I thought it was all one color, but it's not. It's a mix of black and nine through nine. So navy, really dark, dark blue. It's clearly printed. Nicely sticky. See, that's got the better sticky. To me, that's the better sticky. It's like a, the other one I called a sharp or a, a soft sticky. This is more of a sharp sticky strong sticky. I don't know how to explain these, but they just feel different. Comes with the regular little kit, the pink wax, the green boat, and the single placer. Which I think I have like 50 of those by now. Let's look at the drills. Please, a dark navy blue, more browns, more green. That's a sickly brownish green. Bright orange, more brown, and then a bunch of black. I'm not seeing a lot of trash, or any actually. Most of the leaves I can't tell until I actually open them up, start using them, then I'll start getting bits of stuff. But I'm not seeing anything too. I'm not seeing any, any weird shapes or clumps or anything. So far, I'm, I mean, I think I did pretty good on these kits. Sometimes I get some that are just full of trash. These look like they're pretty good. Did you like Scooby Doo growing up? If you've ever watched Scooby-Doo growing up, I loved it. And the next one is another one I believe I got for free. I got this from playing one of the games. It's one of those, I didn't win the game, but you get like little treasure boxes or just random things while playing the game and they'll just occasionally just send you one. And this is the third thing I'd got from this particular game. Got some bookmarks. Got this diamond painting. Just trying to get it up so I could look at it, but it's giving me all these little pop-ups. Let me pause. Alright, it looks like this is two dollars and seventy-eight cents normally. I will try to find a link to put in the description box every time I click on it in my, my little receipt orders thing it takes me to the game instead of to the listing since I got it through the game but it's just a simple little special drill special shape drill I don't know what they call it but you know it's it's one of these little images you know where they're not full coverage I swear what they did was they take some of the little stand-up looking ones and then they just transfer it into a flat canvas but I think it's cute It's sticky, but not where the, you know, the drills aren't going to be. So that's good. I mean, it comes out a little bit around, as it should. Yeah. So they got six collars. Comes with the regular little kit. Pink wax, green tray, single placer pin. This one comes with the special shapes and the, uh, I call them rhinestones. I don't know if they're called rhinestones, but you know, the really sparkly, shiny, pretty, clear colored ones. Pretty, pretty, super sparkly. Colorful ones. I wish you could see it. There you go. I really like these clear ones. 
I think they're really pretty. Kind of like a really pale blue, green, gray. I can't tell. It's really pretty though. And look, there's some star shaped ones. Clear silver back star shaped ones. These are like iridescent. You got the white backing to them. And then these little, what are these, marquee shape, teardrop shape, I can't remember what those are called. Clear ones. So some special shapes and then the rhinestones. This is going to be really cute. These are easy to do. They don't take too long and I think they're just really cute when they're done. I've seen people work on them. I haven't had one like this myself. My focus is doing a weird thing. I think it'll be cute. It'll be nice to put up every winter. Maybe find a little frame for it. A little shadow box, maybe. We will see. I'll probably save that to work on towards winter time. Or maybe do like a winter and summer kind of thing. All right, next, three more things. All right, this one is $3.14, and that is what I paid for it. And it's one of the special shaped stand-up wooden ones. Just realize I'm rattling so much while I'm talking. Hopefully you can hear me okay. I'm like in love with these things. I want some for every season. <laughs> and a bunch for Christmas and winter because that's my favorite. My favorite holiday is Christmas and Halloween, just depending on my mood. And then I love images for both. And then I just love winter scenes. So this is probably going to go up as soon as winter hits and stay up all winter every year. I think it's really cute. Let's see if I can get the film up to check the stickiness. Oh yeah, he's plenty sticky, but only where the <laughs> rhinestones or drills go. Don't you love it? Just kind of old time Christmas or winter scene. So cute. Let's open up these drills. Looks like there is, yeah, nine. So I see an eight and nine down here. So nine different ones. Got just the black drills. Webcam is really not wanting to focus today. I got these really pretty blue ones, the clear ones, pretty green ones. They're so bright. It's not showing how bright they are. Bright green. Oh, really pretty purple. I love purple. Orange. It's like almost ice blue. Then we have the special size, special shape red ones. Don't they look like berries? And then these teardrop shaped yellow. Really pale yellow. Those red ones and yellow ones go around the bottom. Then all the rest. Well, there's it looks like some of the yellow ones on top of his ice skates. And some of the red ones on his hat. 
I really look forward to doing this one. I might have to just do this one soon. I never do whips and chats. Maybe I should do a whip and chat. Go live and do this one. I just feel like nobody's going to pop up in my live and then I'll just be talking to myself. Let's see. Let's put that kid over with my pile of other ones. All right. Got me another set of coasters. This is my third set from this, I guess, this brand. I think I, this is my second one from Timu, and I got one from AliExpress also before. Um, this one is, well, let me see which this is. Here's the Tree of Life. All right. All right, so this one is currently $4.13 on Timu for a set of eight coasters. I think that is a wonderful price for a set of eight coasters. And these come with the coaster holder and they come with the cork to go on the bottom of the coasters. So for four dollars and what I say four dollars and thirteen cents, I think that is excellent. Let's look at the images. Maybe if you can see them, they're just pretty, pretty trees. Very colorful. Very pretty. I don't know if I can, I might be able to put some images up, or at least a image from the site so you can see what they're supposed to look like. Finished. But like I said, this is, I think, the third kit I've gotten that's from this company, and I really like the one I've been working on. Comes with the single placer pin, the pink wax and the green tray with the drills or rhinestones. Someone correct me. Inform me. Educate me. What are they called? Are they rhinestones? Looks like they come with a fair amount. Two, three, four, five, six. Six colors. You know, I forgot to mention them, like the other special ones, whatever. They don't have like a legend. It's just what's on the bag. Like this number one will match like number one on the coasters. So make sure you take note of what number each color is. Pretty colors. Oh, it's so pretty. I've been drawn to it, like the coasters and stuff because of the rhinestones. I work a lot of the, you know regular diamond paintings lately, and then I start. I tried a couple with the special drills, the special shapes, and with the these rhinestones. And I just I really love how they look. They make me happy working with them. So I thought, why not get more? And I have not had much trouble with this kind. I mean, I've had a couple like either didn't have the backing or were like broke. So they weren't like cool little round drills. But for the most part, I don't get like a lot of trash and a lot of, I don't have a lot of issues with any of these special ones. I love that they come with the, uh, the cork backings. I feel like it just makes it even better value. Okay. If I go through these too fast and you have any questions, feel free to comment or email me your questions. One more. This one. box. 
but it's another coaster set. This one is eight piece for six dollars and ninety eight cents, and that's what I paid for it. Does this have one have a name? This one just says Moon Pattern Coasters with do yourself artificial rhinestones. So I guess they are called rhinestones. This comes with the cork. Cork's a lot smaller than the coaster though. Comes with the coaster holder. Oh, these are like really sticky on the side. That feels feels kind of gross. <laughs> They're stuck together. The other ones I've done have been wooden and these are plastic so that's different. I forgot to check the stickiness on those but on those wooden ones I've yeah you know, I've done some from the other from that company and they got a good stick to them. I can't get this to peel up. These uh, fake nails are not helping. Almost got it. So far I am not loving these and they, I paid twice as much for these as I did the other ones. Yeah, they're just like a really gross sticky. <laughs> I wish I could explain it. They're like a wet sticky. But they are sticky. And I think they're pretty. And once I get them done, you know, I'll seal them and everything. It's just have not done them on these plastic resin. I don't know what you call this hard plastic material, but hopefully I can put up some images. But I thought these were pretty with the moons. The different moon designs and they're very colorful. I wish they weren't stuck together. They just feel kind of gross to my hands. Cause like I said, it's almost like a wet sticky and like the, like it spread to the edges and now they're all sticking together. Almost feels like a, like if you put Vaseline on your hands or something. That filling. But the images are pretty. I'll withhold judgment on these coasters until I actually get them complete. Because as long as they look good, it don't matter, I guess, if they felt gross at first. I just wish that the um, the cork actually was the same size as the coaster. Cause I find that kind of off-putting. Which I have some cork backings. I don't know where they are at this moment. And I might see if they fit better than these because I just feel like these seem small. Alright, comes with the single placer pin, the boat, and the one wax. Let's look at these rhinestones. Maybe if I can open them. Like it just comes with 12 colors, but they are pretty colors. I really like that pink and that purple and that. 
they're just so sparkly the way the light shines through them plus the facets reflects the light too so it's just it makes them so pretty and I like that they have the rhinestone black and not just the flat black so they have the silver backing makes it more sparkly but yeah I like the colors I like the images I'm not sure how I feel about the material and, and the cork so we will see after I get them done what how I feel about it I think they'll turn out cute though I think they'll turn out pretty and I think I'll stop complaining but that is my new diamond painting haul. I'm not going to put everything up here because I have it all set to the side, but what was your favorite thing? I think my favorite thing, honestly, is this. This and maybe the fox or Marvin the Martian. I don't know. I like everything. That's why I, I order them because I like them. I'm sure you don't order stuff you don't like. I was surprised to get some of these free and that made me happy. I love getting free stuff. <laughs> kind of disappointed that I paid twice as much for these. And I feel like they're lower quality than the other ones. But I think they're going to turn out cute. So anyway, let me know what you think. And I thank you for joining me again today. I hope you've been enjoying my unboxings. I feel like I've been doing more unboxings than anything else lately. So I'm going to try to get back into uploading my diamond paintings. I'm starting a new one tonight. And I will have that uploaded probably before this unboxing comes out, actually. And I thank you again. Please consider liking, subscribing, maybe sharing this with other people that would enjoy it. Um, let me know if you have any of the kits that I showed or if you're thinking about getting any of them. Um, everything should be in my description box that is available. And I thank you again. I'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye.